Hey guys, my name is Jasmine. Welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about my favorite Taiwanese local food delicacies. Taiwan is famous for a lot of things, but food is definitely up there in the top reasons. Taiwan food is cheap, yet so, so delicious. Some of you may not know, but I'm actually Taiwanese. I often go back with my family to visit relatives, so I have formed a top 10 list of my must-have Taiwanese delicacies when I come back to visit that are either not available or not as good back at my home in New Zealand. Number 10, ice cream, bin chiling. My favorite was at Coldstone Creamery at the department stores. You can choose preset flavors with toppings or order a custom made bowl. And they mix it up for you in front of you and place it in a waffle bowl. I know they are also available in other countries like the US, but in New Zealand, they are not that popular. We actually ate out twice at Coldstone Creamery during our trip. Number 9, Taiwanese Cakes, Taiwan Dangao. Taiwan is the OG for sponge cakes. They are famous for making them so soft and bouncy. You can buy it from bakeries or cafes in the department stores and they come in many different flavors. We went for the matcha sponge cake and annihilated it in a day. You can see my very sleepy jet lag sister here concentrating on her sponge cake at 4 a.m. Number 8, Taiwanese Lunch Boxes, Taiwan Fan He. Taiwanese lunch boxes are cheap and simple, yet yummy. Often they will come with rice, a veggie, and a protein. Often the veggie is cabbage, spinach, or bok choy. The protein is often fried, braised, or minced meat, or seafood. Number seven, beef noodle soup, nyoro mian, another OG Taiwanese delicacy. We ate beef noodles at this place on the way to Sun Moon Lake called Joshi Jia Beef Noodle Restaurant. Nothing like a local made beef noodle soup. Number six, egg dessert, dan ta he hua fu bing. Again, I am aware it is available in other countries, but the egg tarts here are way nicer. You can buy the egg tarts from bakeries, market stores, and cafes. Another dessert is egg waffles. Taiwan has way more wacky flavors like matcha, il grey milk tea, and mochi. We ate our egg waffle at Dadaotong Pier Plaza, where all the eateries are in shipping containers, and then you get to go to the top of the container to eat with the riverside and city view. Number five, fresh bamboo. Xianzu. Living in New Zealand, I have never known the taste of fresh bamboo and didn't know I was missing out until I tried it at Sun Moon Lake. Normally bamboo is quite bland in New Zealand, but in Taiwan it is actually sweet and I was shocked. We recommend going to Yo Yo restaurant. Number four, stinky tofu, cho tofu. This is definitely a Taiwanese delicacy. I promise it tastes better than it sounds and smells. You can buy this at any night market, and we bought this one at Sulin Night Market, easily accessible by the Red Metro line. Number three, hot pot buffet. Everyone gets their own hot pot, and it costs 559 Taiwan dollars per person on weekends. The variety in this buffet is amazing, from their raw foods, cooked foods, sauces, drinks, desserts, more drinks and more desserts. We went to Qianye Shabu Shabu. They have several branches in Taiwan, but we went to the Linko branch because that is close to where my auntie lives. It all started where my second auntie took us there, and since then, every time we come back, she always invites us out to this restaurant. This trip would be the third time in the running. Number two, peanut ice cream roll, Hua Sun Tun Jun. This consists of peanut shavings and ice cream sorbet wrapped in a crepe. If you're feeling crazy, you can also add coriander. This is very delicious and different to anything I have ever had. We had this one at Jilfin Old Street, but we also had it at Danzo Seaside Markets. Any kumara and tarabal dessert with red or green bean also deserves a special mention. 
we had this amazing hot dessert soup in Jiu Fin, which was perfect for the cold, wet weather. The shop was called Aganyi Taro Bo. It wasn't originally on my list as I can make it myself at home. Number one, Taiwanese breakfast, Taiwan Zao Tan. While it may not sound exciting, Taiwan breakfast is cheap and a must have. Often we will order things like fried sticks, sao bing you tiao, sticky rice, nor mi fan, hot soybean milk, dou jiang, turnip cake, lo bo gao, and baked kumara, kao di gua. In Taipei, we will go to Li Ji Soy Milk, as this was close to our accommodation. For four people, the total came to 225 Taiwan dollars, which was unbelievably cheap. I hope you guys have found this video useful. Happy eating in Taiwan! Thank you.